a remote solo. It does require four mallets, as you can see in his hands. That is, um, I was really impressed with Daniel this year. Daniel, uh, he started his freshman year in beginning band, and um, I saw that he was really progressing very well. Asked him to come and participate in our summer band. He wasn't quite sure if he wanted to do it. I said, hey, you know, whatever. You know, don't don't feel obligated, but you know, give it a try. He showed up and he ended up staying. So that's great for us. Then when Daniel tried out for All City this year, I, I kind of made him this year because he's a senior. And um, when I saw him working on four mallets, I was like, oh goodness. I go, who showed you that? And Daniel's like, I don't know, I just figured it out. I go, okay, well let me show you how to do it correctly. So this is a technique. Uh, I personally did not learn how to play this technique until college. I didn't have lessons when I was in high school. and. Um, started playing four mallets when I was a freshman in college. Daniel picked it up, showed him the correct way to hold it, and he just took off from there. And it's really pretty cool to have a student that you don't have to, um, you know, babysit all the time. You show them one thing and they take it and go and they grow in. So I hope you enjoy this. It is a um, one of the college repertoire pieces, and I was doing that to get college, um, college ready Daniel so he can make some auditions. And, see what he can do with his talent. He too got an outstanding performance at the district level. And this, um, yeah. Which by the way, uh, we were just, Booker T got uh, two more than we did. So we were only two schools in the whole district of Dallas got outstanding performers. We were one of them and Booker T, which is the arts magnet, was the other one. Butcher this title. This piece is called uh, Opus. No, don't tell me. Okay, tell me. Etude in C major, Opus number six, ten, whatever, one of those. It's by Musser, which is a very well known uh, marimbist. And we're going to do a little sound check first. Thank you. 